welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Create new agreements based on respect and love. Take the responsibility to make new agreements with those you love. And if an agreement doesn't work, change the agreement, create a new one. Use your imagination to explore all the possibilities. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 34, NASDAQ up 70, S&P's off two and a half. Gold, gold contract up $51.70 trading in 2018 an ounce. We have silver up 38 cents, $23.17 an ounce. Light sweet crude down a buck fifty, trading at sixty-nine dollars forty-one cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. Ten-year note up a full point plus two ticks at one sixteen oh five. The thirty-year up thirty-one ticks at one thirty-one thirty. And king dollar, king dollar trading. All right, king dollar trading up one hundred twenty-seven ticks at one zero two four seventy-five. The euro is out here at a price point of one zero eight. The yen is at a price point of 130, and the British pound is at 122 to 1 U.S. dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at it, man. You, <laughs> This is just as good as you can get, folks, okay? When I just did the update, you know, the S&Ps, you, you got to see this, man. I mean, this is about as great as you can get when you're trading. Bottom line is that I was doing the update, the S&Ps were down at the 39.50. It pops up to 39.93. So you popped 40 S&P points, and you gave up another, let's see, 90, we gave up another 15 just as quick. Bottom line, this is a market that wants lower price, and I expect it's going to get lower price. They just reloaded. That's all they did right there is reload. And let's just take a look at this. I'm curious. Is it, did it hit the 3A2? It went over the 3A2 to the 5-0. You know, bottom line, the expansion contraction Fibonacci sequence, folks, okay, hits beyond belief in fast markets. It just does. I have no idea why uh, it does, but guess what? It does. Gold. Let's go take a look at the gold contract out here. We take a look at gold. What do we have with gold out here? Gold is testing, it wants to test the highs that were generated out here um, a couple days ago. So if we take a look at this, what you're going to see in the gold market, you're coming up to the, well, you're over the, you're in a, you're in a new range, number one. You're, you're, you know, anything over 1,083, you're in the range. The high that we're, that it's going after right now is the 2,031. Right now, you're at 2,015. We go into the and the, I mean, the currency market, this is what it's all about, man. The dollar is running things once again. Uh, let's see. That's the dollar. Let me, get, let me get here. Okay, so the dollar rejected lower price. And it was right back to where it came up the last time. It added strength. The low, when it came off that low, was 101.546. Um, today we hit 101.915, and then it took off, and we're at 102.503. Now, what you have out here today, Yellen, once again, what, what that pop was about also, by the way, um, that was about Yellen's, they just released Yellen's testimony uh, that's going on this afternoon, and she's back again saying, um, here's, there's a deletion, let's see, okay. Uh, okay, so here it is. As I... This is what's deleted from yesterday. As I said last week, the U.S. banking system is sound. The federal government's recent actions have demonstrated that the resolute commitment to trade, the to take the necessary steps to ensure that deposit and savings remain safe. Um, the new paragraph is, that, as I've said, we have used important tools to act quickly to prevent contagion, and they are tools we could use again the strong actions we have taken to ensure that American deposits are safe, and certainly we are prepared to take additional actions. Now, let me show you this, man. You got to see this. Let me pull this over. I want to thank Jacob for putting this together for me. So, where do you see this? Now, this is going to be the new deal, folks. And what this is, this chart, if you can see this chart, I laid this chart over the, uh, maybe I can make it even bigger. Yeah, I can. Okay. So, this chart here, you know, they're worried about the 
regionals, and they better be re worried about the regionals because now this is a J.P. Morgan chart that came out with this, okay? But this, <laughs> this is like so insane, it's unbelievable. When you're looking at this line, this is commercial real, this is lending and commercial real estate. Now the difference, this is where the difference is. You know, you had the Silicon Valley Bank, they, they get treasuries, yeah, they're underwater, bad trade, the whole ball of wax, right? You have um, First Republic, bad trade, they're in municipals, right? See this, the blue line? The blue line is lending to commercial real estate loans. Now, the bottom line is that things have changed so dramatically since COVID that this is a huge problem. The blue line is the amount of loans that were done by regionals, okay? This is, uh, what's that? That's in the trillions, by the way, okay? The large banks, look at the large banks down at the very bottom. The large banks, man, are not there. This is going to be, no, not going to be, this is the problem. This is the problem that, that the Fed knows, the Treasury knows. These loans here are underwater, man. There's no way they're not. They're, they're underwater. That is, you know, the canary in the coal mine. So this thing is just starting. It's not over. It's not even close to being over. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. We take a look at some of the higher volume equities out here. And what do we have? We have Block. Block got hit by uh, Hindenburg out here today. That's down $11.5. You have uh, First Republic. That's down $0.67. Cents. Uh, NVIDIA's up $4.85. You got uh, Coinbase. That, they got hit by the SEC. That's down $11. Inside the NDX 100, the strength versus the weakness inside of the NDX. What do we have out here? So you have Netflix is up 7%, Reg Regeneron's up 5.5%, Micron Tech is up 45 and, and Marvel Technology is up 4 Taken away from it. PayPal down 3 Dollar Store down 25 Sirius Satellite down 23 and Marriott off 23 Inside the Dow Industrials, you're talking about a spread inside the Dow Industrials. This is pretty about as tense as you can get. Uh, Dow Industrials out here, we have a high today of 32,511 a low of 31,866. How's that for a spread? Point, point wise out here, what you have Microsoft putting 29 positive points, Amgen 13 taken away from it. United Health 46, Travelers 18. Stay right there, folks, we'll come right back.